So we're out hunting a uh, finger of the Chihuahuan Desert tonight. So far, um, finding some critters starting to move around. So this is a nice little fat desert lizard here. Little cutie. And then uh, this here is called, uh, let me put this guy down. Go on. Uh, this here is called a hide beetle. I think they're really cute because they kind of play dead, which this one actually is alive. Kind of move its legs around, but I just think they're really cool. They look kind of prehistoric. But um, anyway, I really like these, and uh, so we're gonna let this one go tonight. Check this little guy out. Uh, this is uh, commonly known as a stink bug, and you'll see if you threaten this guy at all, they kind of do their little atomic butt thing. They'll kind of rear up and put their butts into the air. Oh, he's not wanting to be bothered. And uh, they'll actually spray or musk, and uh, it's pretty stinky, but I happen to think they're kind of cute. We got a cool little mammalian den here. It's pretty neat looking. I usually like to take a peek. The dogs usually pop their heads in there. Uh, around here, we've got coyotes, ring-tailed cats, uh, little foxes, and some stuff like that. So whenever I see a hole like that, I just like to take a peek. You can get it. So here's a beautiful little desert lizard. These will drop their tails easily. So I'm being very careful to hold it by the body. But it's just a little beautiful one. So I like to just uh, catch these, take a look. Now this is a very um, odd coloration, but this appears to be a young Virtus. Um, the scientific name is Crotalus um, Organus. It used to be Virtus, and this is so amazing. Now, this is not the typical coloration of any Virtus I've ever seen. This is an amazing find in the wild. This appears to be um, hypo or, I don't know, maybe albino. This is, it's much lighter, which if you notice, we've got a very red sand here. And um, I don't know, maybe, I mean, obviously maybe it's an adaptation, but um, I would say that this little snake is uh, two to three seasons old. We'd have, we've had some dry years, so um, they're not gonna grow as fast. There's less vegetation and, uh, um, you know, less rodents for them to feed on. So, um, wow, this is amazing. Possibly a once in a lifetime find. And it's so insane that we started filming this year because um, I've seen some beautiful things, but never anything this amazing. So, um, I don't know, you can see the buttons on it. It's, it's not very old, but these snakes, this is just a, a mid-sized species. This one's just kind of chilling out here. They're just starting to come out of their dens. It's springtime. And um, so this one appears to be thriving despite its unusual coloration. And so we're just gonna let this little beauty go on her way. And um, <clears throat> this is so awesome that we caught this on film. And um, wow, definitely the find of the day, probably of the year. So amazing.